Welcome back. The holiday season is now in full swing here in Clarion. Yesterday, the official lighting of the holiday tree took place on the university campus. Clarion's very own Mark Despotakis was there with, for the festivities. A new tradition for Clarion indeed. Last night marked the first annual holiday tree lighting outside of Clarion University's Carrier Administration Building. Why start this? Well, I think because of September 11th uh, that it's, it's nice to come together as a community and to remember um, the tragedy, but also to remember uh, what the holidays are all about and to wish for peace and to do it with the ceremonial lighting of a holiday tree. Trees and gatherings of family and friends have always been a part of this time of the year. But this year, those gatherings seem so much more important. This tree lighting service included a moment of silence for those affected by the tragedy of September 11th. One CU student, Candida Robertson, appreciates the tree lighting. And I really like it because I'm from New York, and in New York they have this all the time. So it's just like I feel more at home now that they have like a ritual like this. Like where I live, I look out my window and I see the Twin Towers. Now, like, it's like weird. I went home for Thanksgiving and it was like weird. I, it wasn't the same. Tonight's holiday tree lighting was designed to celebrate the holidays here in Clarion, as well as remember those who were affected by the tragedy of September 11th. But this tradition will probably continue in years to come with more additions. In the future, we'll have like the, the bell tower, which may bring more students down uh, after the bell tower is, is put in place uh, next summer. It's something that a lot of campuses don't do. Um, friends that go to other schools, and I just thought it, it's neat, you know, something that brings the campus together, especially at a time like this. Sometimes, the simple act of a tree lighting can help us through troubling times. Friends, family, even strangers, and people of all ages can gather together and admire the Christmas tree. At Clarion University, Mark Despotakis, TV5 News.